studio, yup. And um, Renee from Jeanne actually um, wrote on the record. Too, okay. Yup. Yeah. And we both worked with her. And it was at the time when, you know, she had the situation with R. Kelly. Okay. And they were moving her away from the R. Situation? Kelly. Yeah. <laughs> they were moving. I don't know what went on, but I just know that mm -hmm. whatever situation it was. I'm and after R. Kelly it. did the first album, and then after that, they, they were just like, no. Mm -hmm. And they started looking for other outside producers, and they reached out to me. Wow. Um, I was honored to do it. What, what, Especially what kind of now, person? when you look back at all of that. It's great. Was she soft spoken? Very was she... soft, yeah. Oh, but really okay. cool. Really, really, really cool. Easy to work with? E very easy. Who was the most difficult person to work with? Jaheim. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Probably. Really? I had, yeah, Jaheim. I had to ban Jaheim from the studio before and everything. Why? Jaheim... He got black? Well, no, no, because, because I, like, Jaheim was just. He wanted it so bad that by any means he would do anything. So if we if we did a demo of a song and he thought the song should be for him, he would come in and take the song and, or take the tape. And I would just be like, Jaheim, don't come in and take these songs mm. because they might not be yours or this ain't yours. He would come in and steal the stuff and then just so he could play Ew! it. Just so he could play it. Right. Now, mind you. Like you would know because he only in the back house. Right. So he would like, and I'm talking about he would he would take songs and put them on loops and just play them all night, all night, fall asleep with them. And you come in in the morning and you just hear the song playing and playing. And I walk in and be like, "How'd you get that song?" <laughs> um, um, nah, such and such, such and such. Like, no, nah, John. So I would have to ban him from the studio. Like, you can't come to the studio for a week or whatever. Let me find out. It was just little stuff like mm -hmm. that. He wasn't difficult, but. It's what about with the something. vocals? Like, was he difficult like that? Like, nah, nah. When it comes to vocals, he was straight. Oh, okay. He yeah, wasn't he was in there smoking weed, bringing holes in the bathroom or nothing like that, right? Nah, Look, smoking why weed. Why are you smiling? The weed, the weed and <laughs> all that stuff probably. That doesn't nah, bother you? Nah, not in the studio. Oh. He wasn't doing that there. Okay. He wasn't doing that there. Because like I said, it was at the house. So none of that stuff was, it was going on over there. They would all go outside if there was any of that, but... Jaheim, the thing is, is that when it was time to do vocals for Jaheim, he was prepared. Because like I said, he would take songs and literally run them in the ground. Mm -hmm. like, he liked hearing himself, huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> he liked hearing himself. He would run it in the ground. So when it came time to sing the records, he knew okay. it. That was one thing he had to worry about. If Jaheim knew a song, mm -hmm. he would do it. What a voice, though. Yeah. What a voice. Yep. Um, a lot of people.